Hey everybody, so I changed my mind about Jordan Peterson. I changed my mind. So a few weeks ago, I made a video where I said that I would always talk about Jordan Peterson and always be interested in him and always laugh at him because he's just too much of a spectacle to, to, to avoid, that I have to look at him, that I have to talk about him, that I feel this desperate urge to do that. Uh, but then he made a tweet that changed everything. I can't show you the tweet, but what it is, is a video that he found of Chinese men getting milked, like getting, you know, milked, okay? Chinese guys getting milked in some sort of a, a factory or laboratory. And his take was that China is acting in disgusting ways, that the CCP is a nightmare. Jordan Peterson looked at a fetish video and got extremely worried that they were doing this. And despite everything, all it could do was make me sad. The link to the tweet is in the description. You can go look at it if you want to. And when I looked at it, all I could do was imagine actually believing what Jordan Peterson believed about that video. And if you did believe it, if you believe that this video of, of, of men getting laboratory milked in China was real, you know, how scary must the world seem to you? How upsetting must it seem? Like, of course, Jordan Peterson had this huge reaction. Of course he was upset. You know, why are they milking people? You know, why, why are you milking people, you know? Why are you doing that? Why are you milking them? You sh you can't, you can't be you can't be milking people in China. This man has been uh, destroyed. Like, he's mentally destroyed. His mind does not function in a normal way at this point. He is very simply not okay. He is not okay at all. And while it's okay if you wanna continue making fun of him, I'm not judging you, I, I can't anymore. It's just, it's too sad. It's too horribly sad. Why are, you, why are you milking people, you know? Why are you doing that? It's sad. Why are you, what's going on? Why are you milking them? He, he got off of benzos. He went into his weird ass coma. He woke up and he's not doing okay now. The man was never an intellectual giant. And now, now it's, it's worse.